we would like to bring you some of the popular Bell's Palsy Home Remedy. When you are having this condition, then you are feeling weakness on your facial muscles. In the most cases this disease is affecting on one side of your face. You fell on the affected face that your face is drooping. Symptoms of Bell's Palsy are coming suddenly. You have muscular weakness. Then you can feel some of the next symptoms, headache, pain near your jaw, decreased taste, pain near your ears, difficulty making facial expressions, increased sensitivity to sound on your affected side, change in amount of saliva that you are producing on the affected side, and also change in the amount of tears that you are producing on the affected side. Mostly the exact reason for this disease is now known. In the most cases the main cause for this disease is linked to viral infections. The types of viral infections can include, respiratory illness, cold sores, measles, shingles, chickenpox, genital herpes, mono, mumps, hand food and mouth disease, flu and cytomegalovirus. If you are feeling some of the symptoms, then you should visit your doctor. He or she will give you the right medical treatment. Also there are many Bell's Palsy home remedy and natural cures, that you can use as treatment. Here are some. 1. I care. If one of your eyes does not close, it is imperative that you protect it as the doctor recommends. Wearing protective glasses during the day, an eye patch at night, and using hydrating eye drops can help prevent long-term damage. 2. Moist heat. Many find that a warm cloth may help resolve pain and discomfort. To relieve tension and promote restful sleep, add one or more of my favorite essential oils for anxiety like lavender, rose, ylang ylang or chamomile. Repeat the warm compress whenever pain reappears, or you need to relax. 3. Massage. Ask your physical therapist for massage techniques that you can do at home. Many patients find gentle massage of the face can ease symptoms and discomfort. In addition, ask for a referral to a licensed massage therapist with experience in Bell's palsy treatment, and book an appointment for not just the face, but for the whole body as the benefits of massage therapy include inflammation reduction, stress and anxiety relief, and improved immune system functioning. 4. Acupuncture. According to the Mayo Clinic, Acupuncture stimulates nerves and muscles, providing relief to patients. In fact, many experience improvement after just one or two treatments. The key is to find an acupuncture practitioner in your area with expertise in treating Bell's palsy. The sooner you can begin acupuncture sessions the better. 5. Vitamin B12. Associated with nerve growth and reduction in inflammation, vitamin B12 may be more effective than prescribed steroids, according to a small study from 1995. Patients in the study were given vitamin B12 injections, steroids, or vitamin B12 injections and steroids. Complete recovery was significantly shorter in the vitamin B12 group with a mean recovery time of just 2 weeks, in comparison to nearly 10 weeks for those on just steroids. 6. Vitamin B6. Associated with healthy nervous system function and eye health, ensuring you are getting enough vitamin B6 is imperative in any Bell's palsy treatment plan. As B6 is water soluble, supplementation is not typically recommended. It is far better to consume vitamin B6 rich foods like free range turkey breast, grass fed beef, blackstrap molasses, sunflower seeds, sesame seeds, and chickpeas. 7. Zinc. Found in every cell of our body, zinc is an essential trace mineral that must be a part of every Bell's palsy treatment plan. Used for 1000s of years to heal wounds, boost immune system response, and support healthy thyroid function, it is also a proven treatment for colds, certain respiratory illnesses, and viruses. Adding zinc-rich foods to your diet like lamb, pumpkin seeds, grass-fed beef, chickpeas, cashews and others can help you heal quicker from the virus, or underlying condition causing your symptoms. 8. Meditation and Relaxation. Relieve muscle tension and chronic pain with guided meditation, yoga, regular exercise and deep breathing exercises. Some studies show that stress may exacerbate symptoms, and there are some reports that chronic stress may lead to relapses. 9. Castor Oil Compress. Used for 1000s of years to improve circulation, 
prevent the growth of bacteria, viruses, and fungi, and to support lymphatic function, castor oil compresses may help to spur healing by enhancing blood flow to the affected areas. Gently warm a tablespoon of castor oil and massage into your face. Cover with a warm damp washcloth, and leave it one for 20 to 30 minutes. Repeat the castor oil compress twice a day until the symptoms have abated. 10. Bell's Palsy Exercises A physical therapist can provide you with personalized facial exercises that can improve the brain to nerve functioning. Simple exercises include wrinkling your nose, smiling wide, frowning, opening your mouth wide, raising eyebrows, winking and blinking your eyes can help to promote healing. Do your exercises a couple of times a day for best results. 11. Biofeedback used for decades to treat a wide array of ailments and conditions including stress, insomnia, chronic pain, and muscle tension, there is evidence that supports biofeedback therapy as a Bell's palsy treatment. Researchers believe that electromyographic feedback improves motor function of facial muscles, helping patients return to normal. 12. Echinacea one of the strongest antiviral herbs available, Echinacea boosts immune system function, reduces inflammation, and fights viral infections, including those commonly linked to this condition. Select a high-quality liquid Echinacea supplement for best absorption. The USDA's Natural Resources Conservation Service indicates that for immune system function, the proper dose is 10 mg per 1 kg of body weight, for a total of 10 days. Use an online calculator to determine the best dose for you. 13. Elderberry Another outstanding antiviral herb, elderberry has been proven to reduce the duration of colds, lessen flu symptoms, fight sinus infections and respiratory infections, all conditions that are linked to common symptoms. A wide variety of elderberry products is available including teas, syrups, ointments, lozenges, and pills. Elderberry is considered safe. However, it should not be used by individuals taking laxatives, theodur, some diabetes medications, diuretics, immune-suppressing drugs including prednisone, and those undergoing chemotherapy.